Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to Mike's Vehicle Spotlight on Facebook today to keep informed on any upcoming videos and vehicles that I have in the near future. That's www.facebook.com slash Mike's Vehicle Spotlight. Once again, thanks for watching and enjoy today's feature. Today's MVS shines on the 2013 Ford Taurus Shell. The Taurus has been on the market since the 1986 model year as a mid-size sedan until its comeback as a full-size sedan for 2010, phasing out the 500 nameplate. The Taurus is still in its 6th generation but sees a slight makeover in terms of its styling and technical features. The show model has been the high performance model of the Taurus since 1989, but was discontinued for the fourth generation Taurus and recently brought back for the sixth. There have been four generations of the show model. Overall, all Tauruses receive a more aggressive looking front end. The show models come equipped with these high intensity discharge headlamps that contain the Taurus's name within the blacked out lenses. Show models also come equipped with a piano black mesh grille with chrome surround and the blue oval in the center. The front bumper includes the automatic parking assist sensors, LED supplemental parking lamps on the corners with piano black accents, and lower center air dam with chrome trim. The Taurus is 202.9 inches long and sits 60.7 inches tall. Today's show is featured in the Ingot Silver metallic exterior color. The Taurus does retain its same side profile design without much change, featuring chrome trim around the windows and slightly sculpted design lines on the doors. Piano black side mirrors are featured on the sides. The mirrors themselves are fully powered as well as heated and include integrated blind spot indicators. The driver's side mirror also includes driver memory preset settings and is auto dimming. Door handles are also color matching with the intelligent access button included. Also seen here is the illuminated keyless entry touch sensitive number pad. At the bottom of the sides you will find black body cladding. Shown here are the optional 20 inch machined and premium luster nickel aluminum rims with black pockets and four wheel interlock disc brakes behind them. Traction control, stability control and curve control systems are all included.
The rear of the Taurus also sees a minor facelift. Show models feature this small rear spoiler at the edge of the trunk lid. The newly designed tail lamps are fully LED and keep connected by the chrome belt that runs through the center of the trunk. The rear bumper includes your rear parking assist sensors, two red light reflectors, and two chrome exhaust outlets within black body cladding. The interior of the Taurus also receives a new makeover for new technology that makes its way into it. The Taurus also includes dual front, front seat, and side curtain airbags as standard safety equipment. Today's show features these charcoal black leather seats with Mayan gray Myco suede perforated inserts, contrasted stitching, and the show name embroidered into the seat back. Both front seats are 10-way powered, heated and cooled, and the driver's seat also features two-person memory presets. The interior door trim features carbon fiber trim. A chrome door handle next to your door lock controls. Your power mirror and window controls on the armrest. And a large door pocket with integrated cup holder. The dashboard keeps its unique sweeping center stack design, which now receives new controls for both standard and MyTouch models. Carbon fiber and metallic trim can also be found throughout. All show models come equipped with the intelligent keyless access system with push button ignition. Models with the MyFord Touch system receive this upscale, illuminescent gauge cluster that features a 140 mile per hour speedometer in between two LCD display screens. The left screen is used to view most of your vehicle's vital stats, like your tachometer, fuel and coolant temp levels, vehicle mileage with two trip computers, additional fuel information, displays any vehicle alerts, allows you to access your vehicle's programmable features, and much more.
The right screen is used to view and control your entertainment settings. Access your phone through the Microsoft Sync system. View a compass. And control your climate settings, all from the steering wheel. There is also an outside temperature display, compass, and clock displays down below. Today's show features the heated leather wrapped steering wheel with suede accenting and metallic accents. The left set of controls include your left cluster display diagonal pad and lower cruise controls. The right set of controls include your right cluster display diagonal pad and lower stereo and hands-free controls. Behind each spoke sits a shifting paddle for the select shift manumatic shifting feature. To the left of the steering wheel sits the automatic headlamp control and interior dimmer switch. Your turn signal stock also houses your windshield wiper controls. The top of the center stack includes the 8-inch LCD touchscreen display that controls the MyFord Touch system, which is standard on show models. MyFord Touch allows you to control all of your infotainment settings effortlessly. Each category is color-coded at each corner of the screen. Red for entertainment, blue for climate, yellow for communication, and green for vehicle and other accessories. Unfortunately, today's show was still in transport mode so not all of the MyTouch features were available for demonstration. The stereo in today's show is an optional AM, FM, CD, and MP3 player backed by 12 speakers provided by Sony. It is also Sirius XM satellite radio equipped. Using the touchscreen for your climate control settings is just one of the many examples of the My4 Touch capabilities. Your emergency hazard switch and CD player slot sit underneath. You can also use the touch sensitive controls to adjust your audio or climate settings. Your ignition control is off to the left side and your trunk release is off to the right. The bottom of the center stack opens up to reveal your automatic parking control, your traction control override, your rear powered sunshade control,
and a 12 volt power outlet. To the right of the shifter on the center console, you'll find a deep hidden storage compartment. And behind the shifter are two hideaway cup holders that are adjustable. You can also take out the centerpiece and make it one large compartment. The shifter is finished in black leather with chrome accents and features a leather boot at the base. The leather armrest opens up to a small storage console with the removable coin tray. Also inside are a set of AV input jacks for the dashboard touchscreen, an SD card slot, two USB ports, and a 12 volt power outlet. The glove compartment is nicely sized. The ceiling features sun visors with your universal garage door controls on the driver's side. Both driver and passengers also receive lighted vanity mirrors. The visors themselves are also extendable. The ceiling console features a place for a pair of glasses, your sunroof controls, and two map lamps. The rear view mirror is also auto dimming. Backseat passengers will have 38.1 inches of legroom, 55.8 inches of hip room, 56.9 inches of shoulder room, and 37.8 inches of headroom. Second row persons also have access to angle adjustable map lamps. Behind the center console sits two rear air vents, your rear heated seat controls, and a 12 volt power outlet. The center seat back folds out into an armrest with two cup holders. And the rear seats can be folded down by pulling on the two side tabs. The large trunk of the Taurus can carry up to 20.1 cubic feet of cargo. Show models do not carry a spare tire but a temporary mobility kit with tire inflator and tire sealant comes equipped.
Show models are powered by a 3.5 liter direct injected twin turbocharged EcoBoost V6 that produces 365 horsepower and 350 pound feet of torque. This engine makes an EPA estimated 17 miles per gallon in the city and 25 miles per gallon on the highway. The Taurus also features a 19 gallon fuel tank. All trim levels are driven through a six-speed automatic transmission. Show models also feature the Select Shift manumatic shifting paddles on the steering wheel and comes equipped with standard all-wheel drive. Once in reverse, the rear-mounted camera is displayed on the touchscreen. Okay, we will now take the short test drive portion of the 2013 Ford Taurus shell just around the dealer lot. Firm and responsive steering. Very quiet ride, you can tell.
All right, and this will conclude our test drive portion of the 2013 Ford Taurus Shell. And that concludes today's MVS on the 2013 Ford Taurus Shell. I'm Michael Adams, and I'll see you guys next time.